Today's topic is vision. When you look at the vision or vision statement of your business, what does it do? What does it provide? Your vision is like the Emerald City. It is the destination for your business. It is a 100 year goal that you will probably never see come to fruition and you are stating it in seven words or less. It is a 100 year goal in seven words or less. You have to start thinking about what are the beliefs that hold true to you as the owner of the business? Where do you want to see the business being taken in the next 100 years? Too many focus just on the next three years, maybe even five years, some even 10. What's the long-term goal of your business? Think about the culture. When you think about the things that you hold true to yourself, the beliefs that you have, uh, what would remain to the business, to the organization as it grows? Uh, what are your statement of values? When you look at what matters to you as the business owner, what kind of things like this matter to you? Be specific. Be practical. What can take place in a hundred year time? A whole lot can. Most business owners overestimate what can be done in one year and underestimate what can be done in 10 or more. So think big. Don't think small. Think big when it comes to your vision statement. This is what will guide your business and becomes the focal point that everyone who you add to your team focuses on. Ours is very simple. World abundance through business re-education. Think about that. World abundance through business re-education. That's extremely large and yet it's extremely powerful. So when you go to create your vision statement this week or re-examine what your vision statement is, how big is it? Is it in seven words or less? And is it truly encompass the beliefs that you have for your business and why people should even join in the first place? I'm Dr. Harley. I'm here to elevate your business and enhance your lifestyle.